Well, Vegas Live with Ninon is always thinking of something new to do, especially for Vegas, because we actually promote Vegas and the entertainment in the business, restaurants, everything. And today we have TC's Barbecue, which is our spotlight for business and our spotlight for Vegas Live with Ninon. Now, apparently, this is how it goes. Apparently, if you watch Vegas Live with Ninon and you go into their restaurant, which is TC's Barbecue, and I will get the address in a minute, and if you mention that you've seen our show, you actually get free dessert. And... Um, I don't know how long these desserts are going to stay there because I'm looking at them all and I'm like very hungry. I mean, I like red velvet and this is apparently a coconut. Oh, well, I, anyway, we'll find out what they are. Sharon, Irving, how are you? Wonderful. Fantastic, Thank now you. that we're here with you. you. Oh, see, he knows the right thing <laughs> to say. Yes. I love it, I love it, I love yes. it. Now, I was watching, last time you came on, you have like 10,000 viewers. You went out to 10,000, 12,000 people. Um, how, do, how are we able to help your business? Did we manage to help you some way? Uh, absolutely. Yes, it was a tremendous help. People Good. were coming and telling us they saw the show and, you know, how wonderful you what are. They mentioned you, know, like, you yes. more than anything. Yes. That was a they said I we came up with some food, but they mentioned you. Which well, was I great. promise. I promise I'm going to come down. So you might even be able to see me when I'm at TC's Barbecue because I might just come down there. So you better keep going there because you might bump into me and I might uh, interview you and I, well, I might give you a present. <laughs> I just might do that. I, like I have that. a secret. But I have a present I can give you. Uh -oh. You come down. Yes, uh -oh. You better yeah. come down. You gotta come down. Sure. Okay. So how's everything going? I mean, I, I notice you're, you're, you're giving stuff away, and you're sort of you're, you promote your business how most people should promote it. Mm -hmm. How do you manage to do that, and how do you know to do that? Go ahead. You just do. You, no, you start. Our, oh, our, Sharon is our social media maven. Um, she's not, <laughs> no, truthfully, she's not super adept with electronics and things of that nature, but she knows how to work on that Instagram and Snapchat. That's all it is. Don't get it. Really and truthfully, she won't allow me on because I tend to have a quick finger, and oftentimes people say things and I retort, and it's not socially correct. <laughs> no, it's not socially correct. It's not a good thing to do to invite people to your restaurant. <laughs> no, not at all. But you know, everybody's entitled to an opinion, even yes. with, you know, the smart bone. So, um, it's really true, and truthfully, the thing is that we found that just giving, we look for an opportunity because we, we got to Las Vegas as a result of Las Vegas giving to us and helping us out. Yes. So every opportunity we get, we try and give something back and it just kind of permeates and it just it's a domino. That domino is the first one and it just knocks down the rest. Absolutely. It's really interesting. And I think giving something away is, and your desserts are absolutely incredible. Yes. Absolutely amazing. But your barbecue, I've heard an awful lot about your barbecues. I mean, what makes you so different? Um, I think that really love yes yeah. our love. Absolutely. that's exactly love. what i was true. going to say yeah. um, true. uh we're all family yes our, our uncle his mother tc is my they're father they're all involved in it in oh, the yes. cooking and yes. putting it yes. together so, so this is like a family affair which yes. is, i think it, it's funny how restaurants are so successful when they're a family affair and you think of the Italians, you think of the Greek, mm -hmm. you think of um, the Asians, the most oh, yeah. definitely. Yes. Yeah. I mean, they all have their family. And when you have the family involvement, I think there's a little bit more attached to it than actually the money coming in. Exactly. So this is an accomplishment. It's sort of, I want to make sure these noodles really taste good. I want to make sure this bar barbecue sauce is really you're, the best. You're absolutely correct. And I think, you know, they have their own thing coming forth and then they feel good about it. Yes. Absolutely. We even have one person responsible for a certain dish so that it always tastes the same. And if somebody else makes it, then they think that they make it better, so yes. they're going to change the recipe. So, yes. we so you don't do that. Have one person. So you want the one person to do each thing, and then you're yes. right. Then that's being consistent. Yes. When you are consistent, exactly. people know what they're going to and what they like. Yes. That's and right. how? And are you thinking of opening up a second one, or are you just going? Oh Absolutely, yes, definitely. Yeah. Oh, she's immediately. Well, <laughs> that's business. because that's what he wants to do. So well, yeah. Well, no, the thing is, like, I, like I explained to the family, when an individual walks in, it may be the first time, yes. and it could be the last time they ever get a chance to meet us and sample our product. Of course. So I don't think it's fair to just consolidate into one location because there are oftentimes people who live in other areas of the city. Las Vegas is growing two million people who say, yes. you know what? Twelve years in, I never knew you existed. Yeah, that's and not good. No, it's a bad. 
it's better really? to have another place as well. And you, you've probably got enough family between the two of you to take care of everything. Oh. And they probably would like that too. They would love it. Well, we came, we came after Hurricane, we 11 family members, and then we just had some more family that was displaced through Harvey. Well, as a result of last week's hurricane, yes, yes. and so they'll be coming now too. So I said, "Well, Jesus, well, we got to open up another store soon because they're going to need so something." To yeah, well, people do. from Houston, you know, there's a lot of people out there that, you know, this tragedy, and my heart goes out to all of you. But a lot of they're now transferring themselves to somewhere else because this is kind of giving, you know, you can use a bad thing and make it into a silver lining yeah, by taking something bad and maybe relocating yourself yeah. to Vegas or wherever but yeah. Vegas is a pretty cool place to vacate because it's growing yeah, the housing sure. here isn't that expensive and you can get a pretty good house that's right for, for a super and, good deal, for a good deal. Right. And the rent here is not as bad as I mean the rent in Los Angeles is four or five thousand to get a nice house yeah oh yeah it's yeah, pretty easy. high yeah, and so high. here is quite a reasonable place yes. to come to isn't right. it yeah. and it's growing it's in the process of growing right I now love Vegas. Vegas I love, yeah. I love Vegas Vegas, Vegas is yeah. great Vegas is, is, is amazing. Um, Nick, I noticed we have a question. What is the question, Nick? I want to know their hours of operation. What's the hours of operation? Uh, we're open every day, Monday through Friday, from 11 a.m. to yes. 10 p.m. every okay. day. And what about Saturday and Sunday? It's the same. Same thing. Yes. So, you're, so it's, twin, um, well, it's, it's, it's uh, seven days a week? Seven days a week. That's amazing. 11 to, uh, 11 to what 7. What is it? 11, 11 to 10. 11 to 10. 7 to 11? <laughs> oh, thank heaven. <laughs> Can you imagine? We'd be serving breakfast. No, we're not. That's, no, no. Not yes. yet. Maybe not yet. maybe in the new location. Well, no, yeah. We used to on weekends, but my granny started singing in the church choir, and she's the egg master, so she wasn't there to do the eggs. And, and, and I said... And it was a disaster. I said, quit the choir, and she's like, ah, quit the choir. <laughs> <laughs> so it was a disaster, yes, so we pulled it off. Absolutely. We took it off. What is your most popular dish that people come in? Apart from the desserts, look at these desserts. Isn't I think, literally, I think we sell more, we sell a, a ton, literally and figuratively, spare ribs. Spare ribs. They yeah, you get the best ribs. of both worlds. Yeah, yeah I think absolutely. it's for spare ribs. Spare ribs yeah. is the best, because that's what you're known for. Yeah. So, the, right. And do you sell the sauce separately? Can people buy the sauce separately? Without yes. a doubt. Okay. Absolutely. We make it twice a day in the kitchen, right okay. in house. Anything else that they can buy there? Yes. Well, I mean, apart from being in there buying the food, but I mean, yep. something. We have a straight out of TC's rib crib t-shirts that are available. Oh, t-shirts available? Yes, t-shirts and our hats are coming in, uh, our TC's hats, because okay. we're doing a uh, Pigs for Kids uh, thing for children, childhood, children with cancer coming up this month okay. uh, for Pigs for Kids, and we're going to incorporate our hats as giveaways and uh, be for purchase later on after. Oh, wonderful. You see what they're doing? They've got all these incredible ideas. You got a, they got another question. What's the question? question? Actually, there's two questions. Two questions. Okay, um, one. Number one, if they can describe what's in their family meal package, mm -hmm. which I have to say is extremely good. <laughs> and number two, if they can describe their desserts. Okay, uh, so please do. let's do the family meal first okay. and then... Okay. You do the family meal and I'll do the... Okay, the family meal consists of your choice of any four of our meats. You can choose ribs, beef, spare, baby back, chicken, hot links, beef brisket, pulled pork, and if you want to, we can actually throw catfish in there also. So any four meats, Three of our large size sides, right? You get side size, <laughs> size sides. You can choose potato salad, coleslaw, candy yams, collard greens, macaroni, macaroni and cheese. cheese, macaroni and cheese, baked beans. Uh, <laughs> what about, exactly what, about fried what about vegetarians? So they, they don't need the meat. So you've got enough stuff. It sounds like they have enough that going. That's a vegetarian. So vegetarians can also absolutely. go there to yes. dismiss the meat. Yes. Oh, absolutely, yeah. without a doubt. Yeah, okay. we have salad. We even do a really nice big TC salad. Also. A TC salad yeah. as well. Without a doubt. Okay, yeah. well, for beans, sure. Yeah. Okay, and then now, desserts. Now desserts. I mean, I mean, these are amazing. Um, this is, a, I believe, a coconut cake. That's our coconut cake, and everything is made. We make everything. Our aunt uh, makes all <coughs> of our. Desserts, all of our cakes. This is a, a our glazed donut bread pudding. It's a bread pudding made well, bread with pudding. English people love bread pudding. But this is made with donuts, not bread. And donuts, yes. That's donuts a little sweet. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> and so that one is our better than sex cake. And what about this cake. is the velvet oh, sorry. cake? Red velvet right? cake. Red uh -huh. What is this one? That's a lemon cake. Okay. And this looks like a double, triple chocolate. What exactly. is it? Exactly. Yeah. Yes. Chocolate yes. decadence yes. cake. Death by chocolate. Yes. Death by chocolate. And then you've got go. something. So what these is this? are this cobblers. Is a oh, cobblers. You've so got we have 
apple cobbler, peach cobbler, and our banana pudding. We have cherry cobbler also. And then you also have, I'm looking at this incredible pie. Does it's that, a, does a that sweet that potato look pie. Yeah, sweet potato. And a buttermilk pie. And this is an old-fashioned southern <laughs> buttermilk <laughs> pie, <laughs> which I have no idea how to make. It's so, so good. <laughs> oh, and a but pralines. It's we have the so pralines, good. Too. And these are the Louisiana pralines. homemade pralines. Oh, the well, some oh, people pralines. say pralines, but I say pralines. Northerners say pralines, in Louisiana it's a praline. Oh, I, say praline. Praline. I say pralines. I say pralines. I say pralines. That's some kind of nut, isn't it? Yes, yes with nuts yes. yes. inside. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, no, what a praline. I have no idea how to make those. Okay, either. we have another question. Wow, this is getting great. <laughs> they wanted to know what the red things are in front of the desserts. Oh, these. So those are our giveaways. We have our TC's barbecue crib bracelets. Everybody loves to have them, and yeah. we and just have come one. in and come That's and get fabric. one free. Tuesdays, every Tuesday, we do a buy one get one free lunch special. So yes, oh, that's we're great. always giving. So you've got a lot. So the promotion of the yes. business, absolutely yes. amazing, which is TC's Barbecue. Um, they are the uh, the winner of this week, aren't you? They yeah. are. Yes. 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 And I'm our sorry. ad our address is three six five five South Durango, and that's between Twain and Spring Mountain. Eight nine one four seven. If and you're map questing it. Our phone number is seven zero two. 451 ribs 7427 awesome. absolutely amazing um don't forget well i've got one more question oh we keep getting questions. and um mr sydney chase says um in october he wants to come visit you Please tell him. Mr. I'll go Jay, with him. Sydney. Sydney, I'll come with you. We'll all go. Is Julie and tell him in October he'll still get <laughs> a free it. dessert. Julie, yeah. Making him hungry. He'll still yeah. get a free dessert. Hey, Julie, are you going to be in town too? She's probably going to say yes. So the two of them will be here together. And then I'll join them. And then Nick. And then we'll also have Janelle. We'll make a big party. I love we'll it. Have, we'll have a Vegas Live with Ninon yeah. party going yes. on. Good okay? times. Absolutely. Good times all By the way, I want to congratulate Sid and his wife. Um, they've got this new radio um station that they're on and they, they're introducing their I think it's called oh dear what's the name of it Sid help me um, <laughs> anyway they talk all about real estate and I noticed they were on I watched them because they did their show on the 3rd of September but this is a new thing for them they're doing fabulous they're doing great and uh, Good luck I said them. congratulations. Thumbs up. Sid Ann, Julie, <laughs> Julie, and Julie. Yeah. Congratulations. Two, two thumbs up. No bull money hour. No bull money hour it's called. No bull money hour. And um, I believe it's on every, is it Sunday? Whenever it is. No. Uh, anyway, we'll be right back. Vegas Live with Nina. Don't forget to visit TC's Barbecue.